Hi guys, welcome back <coughs> to my channel. Today you join me for a really cool game called Games of Token. Yeah. In this game, no, sorry, 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 sorry. Before we do that, I want to start off by saying sorry for no upload yesterday. Um, the, or on Saturday. The reason why I didn't upload is because um. On Saturday, people came round, so obviously it's harder to record when people are around your house. Um, on, and yesterday, I had to go out to Merry Hill. But while I was in Merry Hill, I bought a Roxio Game Capture HD Pro card, which I'm going to, which once I get another HDMI cable, so I can actually see my TV when I'm playing my Xbox. Um, I'm going to start uploading um, videos from console, so what would you like to see? But yes, that's a very quick recap why. And yeah, let's get into this game. This game is a tycoon, you you know, you should know by the name. Um, you have to make new games, um, try not to go bankrupt making them. Oh, okay, thank you. We'll make you... Okay, we'll do it okay. You have to make new games, try not to go bankrupt making them. Obviously, make as much money as you can, so you need to make the best games you can. Um, uh, sorry. And, yeah, then you get to, you know, if you go bankrupt, it's game over. You have to be careful, because this actually comes up quite fast. And it's counting the weeks, and then, you know. So, yeah. Um, let's just, really, so... You have different things you I want you to research. Uh, you have all these different things you can do. Um, that's 500k. I'm not gonna do that. That's a bit too much. Maybe. Wait, no, maybe not. I haven't got 100 RP. Okay, RP is research points. Um, so I haven't got enough to do anything. So let's develop a new game. Um, there is one really easy way to win this game. Right, one stupidly easy way. Let's make a sci-fi action game. We'll call it Doctor You. Um, <laughs> so good at names, I I need to actually put a gap there. There we go. Um, Doctor You. What? What's the attack? Attack of of the what's something? For, let's just put robots. I don't watch Doctor Who, so. Mature, medium game, pit topic, sci-fi. Obviously, you can see which ones I've used more. The medieval. I like making medieval RPG games, military, military uh, action games. Obviously, virtual pet, um, uh, casual games for the little children, and then the sci-fi games for the adults. Like, this. and then this is obviously a action game. So you get these ones. You can research more. Yeah, this one I've researched. So you start off with all these. And then I put action. You can have two, but for this I don't really need to. So pick platform. Um, it, the mature games like this do best on PC. Uh, the game engine you can make your own game engines. I'll go into that in a bit. This is my hash, my best game engine hashtag get wrecked because that's why it does it wrecks people. If we go next, you can choose from your graphics. Obviously, we want 3D graphics. I need to research version two of 3D graphics. Just talking about that. No, every now and then this will pop up asking you if you for a game convention would you like to take place in having a booth? I am going to have a medium. No, I don't think I will. Yeah, I'll, I'll have a small booth. But it can increase your fans. So yes, you have these bits. Then um, so you know it does give you hints as to what's more important. So if we bring the story and quest down a bit. We'll have the gameplay right or we'll bring the engine up some more. And here you have all your staff, which I'll go into in a bit. Uh, this is me. I'm the main guy. This way I've got the most stuff. Um, who's got the most tech? Me. So I'll go into the gameplay. And who's got the second most? You. You can go into the engine. And then uh, story quest doesn't need to be too good. So you can go there. Yes, indeed. So yes, you, you have your staff doing different things up here, you've got your bugs in the game, you you got your points for design, your points for technology, and then obviously as you do it, okay, as you do it, um, you get research points. Um, 
I once made a jackpot. I made a um, um medieval RPG, but uh, and if, if like you said, there's no particular strong trends at the moment. When there is strong trend, if you make something in that one, it's going to sell a lot. So you have to pay attention to that. So yes, uh, level design. Obviously, I've got the most design, so I'm going to go there. AI, you've got the most text, so you're going to go there. And dialogues, I'll, gi I'll just give you a job. There we go. And obviously, you got here your hype. This is the game convention for Doctor You Attack of the Robots. Obviously, this will add some more hype to my game. Um. If you get in the top 100, I think something happens, but I don't know because I've never been in the top 100. So this is actually one. No, it's not. I had 900,000 ones. Yes, indeed. So yes, we keep making this game. Obviously, you can see the hype has gone up, which means which means it is going to sell a lot more. But the reviews for it might go down because of what people are expecting. So if we have this fairly high. We'll have this kind of lower. Graphics, so yeah, you have to look at this stuff. I think I'll give. Well, I'll just realize you've got more design than me. Oh, wow. You can go there. Um, well designed. Wait, no, shouldn't you go there? No, no, I'll do well designed then. Um, there, and then sound. You've got the most technical, logical things. Um, as you can see, you have these bits here, which you guide by, rather, or research by making your own custom engines. So yes, you can see the hype is actually getting quite big for my game. I once had the hype on 100 and that game was the uh, medieval RPG which are called Skyrim. Now obviously here you have to wait for the bugs to go and then sometimes they will accidentally add bugs which can be really annoying. My new record, my guesses are this game is going to sell. A bit personal, re reach with a level 5 with character, okay. Someone on your team has reached experience level 5 is another special training item called boost. The training is for it is expensive and you can only do it once the character has at least 500 design or technology points but with the investment is well worth it. Okay. Once you can the boost allows you to temporarily, temporarily increase the output of your staff and can really help you make a hit game. Nice. Special training for you. Diff. That's, that's me by the way. Um, I did have an old one but I, I went bankrupt. Which I should probably tell you about now. The first review. All right. Okay. Let's just go for the reviews. Let's see. Let's see. Is it going to be good? Is it going to be good? Is it seven out of ten? Good game from Star Games. All right. Fair enough. It's good. Had worse. Seven. Nice experience. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Eight. Very enjoyable. Yes. You're my man. Game hero. And seven. Sci-Fi and action is a great combination. Why? Right, thank you. Not too shabby there. So obviously. Classics way too high in their office. It's so good. In condition. Um, yeah, yeah, half. I've got enough money to, and sometimes you will need to listen to your staff. Else, if you, if they, um, because they ask you to fix your office and that, like make it better. And, uh, if, if you don't do it, they'll start work, they'll stop working harder, and then they'll require to go on vacation more. You have to send them on vacation if they get too, like, um, worked up, worked out, I mean, as you see over here, you can see this game is selling quite a lot. I started on 4.9 million, didn't, 4.3, I started on 4 point something, I'm on 5.3 now. So I've had about a million, um, yes, indeed. So yeah, that's pretty much how you win this game, just make a sci-fi action, and you're fine. Uh, which is one weird thing, but I suppose it's good, all good is good. But yeah, let's talk about bankruptcy. Um, if you if 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 in the first stage you go past um minus fifty grand, you go bankrupt, and then the bank offers you some money, but they want that money paid back with a bit extra in a few months. So the game you're currently making needs to do really well. Right, let's see. This made three million eight hundred ninety-four thousand five hundred eighty-three in sales. Um, if we right and then let's just quickly send you to generate a game report. This will help us with the uh, the um, the um, what's the word? This will help with the hints as to because like if you saw on the scrollers, there's little pluses and minuses which shows design is important, but these are 
sort of thing. So the pluses are the important ones, the minuses are the not so important ones. But yes, you can see this guy's got a bar next to him. Uh, this means he's being worked out. And this guy has. That's very really good. Dialogue seems to have been alright. Addition and so self publishing. Right, yes, I'll talk about that now actually. So, send these guys on vacation or holiday if you're actually a person. <laughs> um, yeah. I'll research some. Oh, sugar. Wait, where wasn't the boost thing? Where's the boost? Boost. Oh, I need more things, don't I? Okay, um. Okay, I need 220 RP and 1 million. Ooh, what's the your t Oh, design your t Okay. Um, I think you have to do that halfway through your game then. Oh, these guys are coming back, so no, I'll show you what the publishing deals are. Um, publishing deals are they'll give you a topic and they'll say what console they want it released on. They'll say um, the minimum score it has to get and it has to be a medium sized game or a small sized game. Um, so if you're actually doing that the game and it's like a good score, you now this one, this particular one, would pay me one hundred and twenty thousand. Um, but if I if I failed it for them and I didn't get that, they take away two hundred thirty-five thousand from my bank account. And uh, I don't think I finished saying what I was saying about the banks earlier. Uh, the banks will offer you to pay you back, and they want all the money back with a bit extra. So obviously, you make need to make your game that you are making currently really, really good. Um, and then you need to try and not spend too much money. You want to make it. Um, you need to make it really good because you got to remember the monthly cost will come along. Like for me, it's quite a lot. Um, vampire action. I haven't got vampire. Can we research vampire? You. You're still coming back, aren't you? Research. New topic. Um, sorry, pardon. Actually, we've got all these topics there. These ones, see, these are the sort of ones I haven't have researched. These ones I haven't, because... Uh, screw it. Let's research vampire. Vampire could be a good one. You research that. You research... Obviously, you will not more topics to research as you do. Comedy. Okay, I suppose we could do a comedy game. I'll research uh, Spy Game. Ooh, Spy Game. Why aren't you coming back? Why aren't you coming back? Oh well. I'll quickly show you the contract deals. Fun contract work. Um. Uh. Yeah, you have to do things, and then the bubbles they'll go up and minus the things, and then you have a certain amount of time to do it if you actually do it you get this much money if you don't do it you lose this much money so these ones are some of these are a bit harder but they get easier the more stuff you have this this looks like the easiest one uh the shoes back now can you research a new topic yes you can what can you research government kind of don't want to but i need to to get the next one okay start research Innovation consoles on the earliest next year. How do I proceed with this? Hmm. Yeah. Right, right here. Can you research anything else? Is there anything else for us? Pirate. Okay, we could make a, uh, a good pirate game. Uh, obviously, they use these research points, so this is 10 RP for each one. This doesn't actually cost. Oh, yes. Another way, another good way, I've just remembered, of making a lot of money, I'll show you now with the game, once these guys have done researching, and now I'll actually save the game there, because I do not want to lose this game. Uh, let's have a small booth, you've completed private, you've completed that. So, if we actually save, 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 you need to do click save a few times, because for some reason it doesn't work, so I'll make one more game, and then I've think we should end the video there so yes the really easy way of making games is um make the sams um i can't remember which number this would be because i make so many so let's just have the sams the the version with 
donkeys. No, no, no. <gasps> With unicorns, because I have the two things in the version. With unicorns. Pick topic. Oh, can I only have one topic? Oh, lol. Okay, I have two jumps. Wait, where's life? Don't I have life? Oh, I thought that might be my other game then. Ah, that was my other game then. Oh. Hey. Hey. I don't have life. Alright then, so I don't have life. I was thinking of my other game. But, alright, let's go for a... We can still make a city game, can't we? And then it's... Wait, no. What genre would I normally have it? Simulation? City simulator? City adventure? Ooh, an adventure city. Let's go for... Um... Right, so I don't have life. Oh, well. Let's go for... City, city, explorer, uh, X. I'm not very good with names. This is going to be it for everyone. A good medium game. Adventure. Can it be anything else? No, I don't think so. Platform. This play, st play system 2 just best for everybody. Get rid. I forgot to show you that. Um, we'll do that. I forgot to show you creating the custom. Can I do it? Oh, yeah. We have marketing. So, as you do in this game, you can advertise it in magazines, magaz magazines, rather than magazine demos, small marketing, large marketing. Um, very much, I've got 500. Hmm, I might actually do this one. Yeah, let's do that one. Um, right, okay, so we've got the things. So, um, they get set to whatever you had your last one as. So, the request doesn't need to be too high, I think it's just simply um, exploring. Gameplay needs to be up. Engine needs. Why does gameplay need to be up? Don't. I'll make it fairly high. Um, there we go. I think that's the right character you did. Yes, Karen. Uh, I don't know for that. Oh, the engine. Yes, yes, yes. Okie doke. <coughs> I um, just realised I think I set this game to multiplayer as well. <laughs> oh, that's cool. You can multiplayer around with your friends. Right, next. Look at our um, thing. Our convention thing. City Explorer X, that's my company name by the way, if you saw it on the wall here. Like I said, I just smashed the keyboard for my name and that, because I thought I was going to go bankrupt and then I realised, wait, you can save your game and I did really good. Yeah, we had, we had, mm, fair enough. Alright, this is Jason Green from Gaming World, going to go the big resort, he's working on a new game. I would be willing to share some information, of course. Many of me just curious what decisions I'm going to make in the game, uh, what prioritise game. See an adventure game, can you tell us? Um, well, since it's in that, yeah, it's more around world design. Thank you for my time. Obviously, the hype builds up because of the marketing. Um, you can see the hype's going up. Uh, over here, we have your fans. Oh, right, next. Dialogues does need to be high for this. Uh, who's doing the dialogues? Well, you are actually a good one. AI, goodness of... Pretty much everything here needs to be maxed out. So, who's got the highest tech? Me. I can't give myself more than one job. Um. Oh, wait, no, you've got a higher design than me, haven't you? Yes, and then. We've got this. Yeah, right, okay, let's do it like this. So, yes, the hype is building up. up. We can add more staff if we want to. We can put our budget for them. And yeah, I've got one for everything, so the demos, the show reels, and the other one, I can't remember what it was. Um, right, world well, design needs to go up, uh, graphics up, sounds maybe not so much. Um, right, I've got the best design, so I'm going to give myself that. Um, I'm going to take myself off that world well, design. Wait, no, why, am I, why aren't I going on? Right, put, put you back, go away. Left to replace your graphics, you've got the second mouse design, so you can do that. There we go. Sound, yes, I think that would do. It's an open world game, obviously, since six next um, city exploration game. Uh, you get these every now and then. Decrypt message, the first special of embarrassing from research. You can do these. Well, I think you might get... No, 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 no. I don't want to steal other people's crap. We could have been the life game. We could have made a load of money after Sam's, but... Let's finish the game there. 
Um, so yeah, you get your points in that, and then you get your XP. Your people make release the game. New research phase, but Easter eggs and uh, Easter eggs would be good. Easter eggs would be the perfect thing for this game, but obviously that's too late now. Let's wait for the reviews, and then we can end the video. What's the reviews? Oh. 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 How is that best of three? How can it be bad? This is a city exploration game. It's just not a game. Sit there. Explore the city. <sighs> well, it looks like you still sold it off, so. <sighs> yeah, you do lose some fans if you make really bad games, and you gain them if you make good games. Um. Could she show you the custom engine? Right now. No, you. You, 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 you. Generate gaming pool. That one. Me. Uh, create custom engine. So you got your name for the ranger and you got I always like to give my cool name so hashtag swigs yolo There we go <laughs> So yeah you can better use your experience I would love that So yeah this is gonna be the next best uh, so you can choose your thing what you're gonna put in it your story blah 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 So yeah let's create the engine And then we have these remaining and then we have to put them in and then we keep making the money off this if, is it, I wonder how much money this is going to make if it will make a few millions or what Since you won't know that good of a game It might make a lot of money, I'm just losing fans City Adventure is a turn becoming hell AI seems to be not important for this game to game I don't think I did make, did I? Yeah I did because if you want to talk to the people right? Oh forget it Don't even care This keeps me <laughs> This keeps making money the sales are going back up though. Uh, yeah, the sales are going back up. But I'm losing more fans. Why would the sales be going back up? I don't, I never understood that. When you make a good game, it'll go down and now go back up. Mbox 360. Oh my god, so original. A massive impact on, yeah, uh, right. So when this new console comes out and it has a massive impact on the gaming thing, on the gaming community, you need to make games for that one because they will sell a lot more. It didn't sell too much, but um, yeah, they'll sell a lot more. <clears throat> I think that's about it for this video, though. Um, let's look at my game history. I'll show you every single one of my games I made. Let's go all the way to the very first game. First game I've made was Superman Simulator for the G64. It was number 54 in the sales rank. It got me 63, well I'm not going to read all this there, but it made 77k and I only got that much money from the, uh, I spent that much and so that was pretty much what I made. Then there's, and that got a 4.25, then there was, um, hey yeah, which was a ninja game, I do remember this one, uh, doesn't it tell me, I saw this one, to yeah, it oh it's here, ninja action game, yeah I do remember this one, this one made me quite a lot. Which was all good. Then there was Clue Don't, which was apparently a terrible game. I do remember. Yes, because Mr. Julian Strat Mr. Ian strategy games are so bad. Oh God, I don't understand this game. There's Pez. It's about with his egg, so it's not the actual one. Income made a lot of money, 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 money. Seven point seven breakthrough, which was a prison prison game. Where it was a strategy game and you had to break through. Uh, that was totally not named after that one Queen song. 7.5 made a lot of money also. Star Battles, this one. This was the one that blew up and got me out of the garage and into the new office. This one pretty much saved me. Because um, I did owe a bank quite a lot at the time. So that one saved me. And then here I made the Toy Story game, which is a Wild West adventure game. I was thinking of Woody, but it didn't work. I only got 3.5. I lost a lot of money. Uh, World War Two Behind Enemy Lines. Kind of like a cliche name. But I made a fair bit of it. A history action game, by the way. And this one was my kids' approach. I made the Nintendo Donkeys, which was a virtual pet casual game. Yet again, I made a fair bit of money after that. And we had the UFO game called Space Invaders and Ripoff. This one did well, quite good. PC. Uh, card, when will this end? 
sci-fi action game. I just used sci-fi because at the time I didn't have military and I was like, oh, why? Why not? As you can see, the sci-fi games make quite a big book. And then we had Falcon Wright, so here, which was not a copy of Falcon Wright at all. <laughs> From a lore RPG game, it did it did all right, I suppose. For little children, I think. Oh, it was for everyone. And then we had another sci-fi action game made a fair bit of money on this one. But I lost some because of how much I spent and banks. And we made another card game. This one also blew me out the water. This one generated 1.5 million for me. Um, which is like the actual card games, I suppose. This one, I just pressed two random buttons and made it and made a million pounds. So, you know, why not sci fi action game? Battle Landscape Multiplayer! <laughs> I'm very good with names, aren't I? Yes, indeed. And that one made a fair bit. More sci-fi <laughs> That one, as you can see, sci-fi action games make a large, large amount of money. Uh, Skyrim, this one, this one. Oh my god, this is my best game. It made 10 million, it sold 1.4 million units. And it only cost 250k to make. <laughs> Oh my god, oh Jesus, 10 million, that one blew me out the water. This was when I was like, I don't really need to worry, worry about going bankrupt anymore. This one, uh, the Dino Hunter 3001 Hunting Adventure Simulation didn't do too well. It got five, uh, 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 what? I remember it getting worse, but it did make a lot of money. That to you, Attack of Rums, we just made that, this one did incredibly well, 3.2 million. And we made this and lost money making it. So yeah. That's this game I'm going to save here. And I'm going to also end the video here. So thank you guys for watching this video. Um, this game is available on Steam 6.99. It's a really good game. I do recommend it if you like games like this. I don't normally like token games. But I do enjoy this game. So yes. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you in the next video. A goodbye.